What you guys got another video here for you now this one is about where is Windows and media player inside Windows 10 now not all versions of Windows 10 comes with uh, Windows media player so for instance the N and KN editions of Windows 10 include the same functionality as Windows 10 except all the media related uh, parts or technologies for that uh, operating system are removed including Windows Media Player and other types of pre-installed uh, media apps like music, video, uh, voice recorder and also Skype and stuff like that are removed uh, from that particular build. So let's take a look here at uh, this build here what we've got so if we right click on the start button here and go to system and this topic was brought up on the forums someone said they've got Windows Media Player missing and uh, he had the latest version of uh, Windows 10 so if we come up uh, to our system here uh, we can check our system for uh, what type it is so if we look down the bottom here you can see it's Windows 10 Pro N so it is the Pro version but it's the N version and that's the version for Europe uh, which uh, has that missing okay the KN versions have it missing as well now also uh, if you're using the preview uh, build and there is talk about them removing Windows Media, Media Player altogether from uh, the next update I think which has been mentioned on the forum which we'll have to wait and see whether that is actually because I can't find no uh, information on that uh, on the uh, website so what we're going to do here is go to control panel and it's going to control panel here and if we go to uninstall a program and then go to uh, turn windows features on or off inside here you sometimes get media in here but you can see it's all been removed inside here it's not there and that's because this version has it removed uh, from from the uh, build itself now if you look at this uh, website here I'll put up these links in the video description for you, you can see a media feature pack for n versions of Windows 10 and you can see here uh, this is the details where you can get it so I will leave the link in here if you are running this version and you do want to use uh, Windows Media Player then you will need to download the media feature pack okay and there's some information here as well and I'll put all these links in the video a description for creators update and other bits and it gives you more information here as you can see music video, uh, video voice recorder Skype and so on has been removed so let's go ahead and install this and see if we can get this working so I'm going to go ahead and download the 64-bit version now this is the version I'm using you can also find out what version you're using by going to your system here and this will give you the information about what version of operating system you're using so system type is 64-bit operating system okay it's very rare that you use 32-bit nowadays but just in case so I'm just gonna click on this here so that's now give us the option to save it or open it I'm gonna go open here and let that open now if you come down to here now if we go down the bottom Windows Media Player you'll see it's not showing up here as well so it's not on the system so what we're going to do is install this uh, feature pack here I'm going to get accept and this should start to install this on our system now you can see uh, this here this is the number it's installing which is the KB4039813 that's installing that update and that should give us this back now we will give you another uh, video after this one which is alternatives to Windows Media Player and some of the best options for you because that's another topic which we was talking about on the forums which I thought would make a good video for people that don't want to use Windows Media Player or if they do take it away it will give you options for those uh, once they do remove it if they remove it now this sort of video is going to be useful for people that are asking the question where is Windows Media Player and also for technicians where 
customers ask them uh, they haven't got Windows Media Player and they want to have it installed, it'll also help them to know how to do it as well if they don't know. So what we're going to do here is quickly restart our system. Click on Restart Now. You'll get Windows ready. And there we are back at the uh, desktop here. And this is the latest version of Windows, which is the Creators Edition. Now, if you're using the uh, preview build as well, you'll probably notice that the uh, Windows Media Player is removed from that. And that gives, gives me an, uh, a sign that maybe they are thinking about removing it on the next build, I don't know. Uh, so what we're gonna do here is uh, come down the bottom here. And there you go, as soon as I put Windows media player in the bottom you can see now that is put the media player back onto our system and that's basically how you can do that it also adds in a few other features like a voice recorder skype and stuff like that as well which was removed from that build and that's pretty much it that's just a quick video to show you uh, how to reinstall a windows media player if it's missing from your build and uh, that's the answers i hope that uh, help you out my name is Brian from brightechcomputers.co.uk. Thanks again for watching, guys. Have a great weekend. Happy Easter. And I shall see you again for another video real soon. Bye for now. Now, if you haven't subscribed yet, hit the big red subscribe button on my YouTube channel and hit the bell notification button next to that to be notified when we upload new videos.